Enough! Just... Uh oh! Uh -huh. Time to blow this fuck. I'm in the alley with the car, Ryan. Hurry! Michelle, keep the engine running. I'm on my way. I just gotta say, you don't fuck around. In for a penny. All right. Now we're getting somewhere. Tony threatens you on the day of your dad's funeral. You decide no deal? Yeah. So now you're in a war. You go to the casino to find him. He's not there, but his brother is. Oh, his brother? Oh, I can't remember. Sure. <laughs> so you blew the place sky high? No, there was a gas explosion. Oh, yeah. And no one got hurt either. That was lucky. Yeah, really lucky. <laughs> so Tony told you not to push back. His casino goes up in a fireball, and his brother's dead. Is that it? Mm, oh, I think I broke a window. Really? Was it worth it? Did you find anything? Yeah. Okay, good. And? Well, after the casino, I thought it was time for some culture. Culture? Mm-hmm. Cool. Can you sit, please? You're making my neck sore. <laughs> sure. Well, I've had worse nights in the casino. <laughs> That got out of hand real fucking quickly. The plan was to kill Tony, not his brother. Accidents happen. Well, Tony was supposed to be there. Have some good information, sis. Fuck off. Well, he certainly knows he's in a war now. What did you find out? Tony's art gallery. He seems to be spending a lot of time there. Tony Sharp, patron of the arts. Fuck it, hell. It's all about his ego. He wants respectability. By the looks of it, a new exhibition. We need to figure out what he's really up to. Yeah. I'm gonna go and find out. You're just gonna walk in there? Oh, I got it. Why don't you take a beret and an easel and then you can really blend it? <laughs> yeah. Try these. How do I look? Wait. Where did Ryan go? <laughs> it was right there. I was just talking to him. <laughs> Fucking hell, bruv. Ryan Marks, man of a thousand faces. <laughs> teach you that in the army. All right, all right. <laughs> You need to get into that gallery and see what's happening. Yeah, I'm on it. If Tony's there, you know what to do. Wait, Mum, I just got an email. I'll put it up on the screen. Marks, you fucking coward! You're fucking dead! Dead, you fucking hear me! Find him! I want him fucking dead. Where's Kayla? Where's Kayla? We'll get her here! Now! You fucking can't hide, Marks. You're fucking dead. You hear me? Keats did fuck all to deserve that. You're fucking dead. Find him. He seems to be a bit upset about something. We need to get this under control. All right then. Let's get going. Be careful. Hello. Welcome to the Anthony Sharp Modern Art Collection. Named after yours truly, and entrusted in perpetuity to the people of London by one of their own. I'll be your guide throughout your visit. Truth be told, 
I was a bit of a scallywag in my younger days. But I always had a passion for art. When I was 12, me and my mates painted a mural on the wall of the local chip shop. The owner, recognising the obvious quality of the work, decided to give us regular payments to maintain the artwork. Other local business owners soon entered into a similar arrangement. I'm joking, of course. We all ended up in a local newspaper. I love it. People have an image of me. I know that. Working class lad turned property developer. They think all this art stuff is an affectation. That somehow I'm putting it on. But really, it ain't. I know there's more to life than money. Art. The next exhibit is anamorphic. That means if you change perspective, you'll see something quite different. To get the most out of it, you just need to keep moving around, altering how you look at things. A bit like life, really, in my experience. Who's pulled the short straw, then? You're not Big Phil again. One and only. He likes doing the night shift. Says he can catch up on his heads. <laughs> Bollocks! Don't tell me. You've forgotten again. Uh, no, I haven't. Year the Titanic sunk. What are you hiding in there, Tony? So Charlie knows the situation. This isn't the old Tony. This is something different. It's Charlie, Mum. He gets it. His crew was solid. Fucking loons, to be honest. She'll be safe with him. Also, he's brought in more people. Serious people. Tony's got money, weapons, even more men now. We've got to match him. We will, Mum. Don't worry. How about you? How'd you get on? There's some sort of vault in the centre of the gallery. Might be something in it. Probably where he keeps his fucking ego. Yeah. Reckon you can get in there? Forget I said that. Charlie's men. Right. I need to marshal the troops, make sure everyone's on the same page. I should only be a couple of hours. Get into that vault and see what you can find. And boys? Be careful. Yes, Mum. Ah, all right. So, how do we do this? There's only one guard on duty, Big Phil. Heavy sleeper, by all accounts. One guard? Yeah. Well, it is supposed to be an art gallery. What are you two waiting for? Well, go on then, fuck off. Come on then, let's go and see some art. Well, I didn't tell you, I posed for a live drawing class once. That was interesting. <sighs> what took you so long? <sighs> okay, the frequency of whispering is much more prominent to the human senses than just talking quietly, yeah? You what? The frequency... <laughs> Don't whisper, just talk quietly, yeah? Okay? Come on, let's go. Ooh, look. Art. <laughs> I suppose. This is very... tall. <laughs> Must have taken them ages to set these up. Mm. Huh. Look very sturdy now, does it, Ryan? God. Oh, nice use of that special forces stealth there, mate. Oh, mind you, I think it's an improvement. 
<laughs> ah. Come on. Let's get to the vault. <laughs> 